We can get our uh, get ourselves together on the mics here, gentlemen. Hello. 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 That's one. That's another. Hello. Yeah, testing. So, testing. So totally pro here. You know, not really doing proper sound checks or anything. Ah, oh, whatever. Got, we got one over there. It's all good. We got another over there. And so, yes, so, yeah. yes. Hubba, hubba, gentlemen. <laughs> okay, so we, no, no, that's for later. You, okay, you, hold on a minute, will you? So we have tonight on, <laughs> on Noise on CJSW, Mark Fleischacker, Scott Monroe, and a uh, and an unintroduced uh, co-conspirator. Uh, my name's Chris. I I brought these in, guys into play. It's part of this is part of the Bug Incision Radio series. Uh, third Thursday of every month, we have a. Uh, uh, performance on the radio. Um, last year we had a live performance series at Soda, which uh, was mainly trying to deal with uh, playing with people that had never met before, and now we're working with people who have wanted to explore playing in a more extended way. So these two have done that, and there's other other people, but that's what we got tonight. So apparently, I'm part of a radio series that I wasn't aware of. Ah, it's, <laughs> it's, it's a secret. Radio. This, this is, yeah, it is a secret. This is improvised as it gets. <laughs> no, there's, a, there's a website. Um, it's myspace. dot com slash bug incision radio, all one word, and that has all the lowdown. Also, myspace. dot com slash bug incision has all the information. Um, but uh, yeah, we're just trying to have some fun on the radio, basically, and put, mm-hmm. this, put the stuff out there. Good times. Okay, <laughs> so tonight it's uh, tonight the specialty is vocals, like we- weird ass vocals, processed rackets, senses of humor, trombones. Uh, yeah, I brought my trombone. I don't know whether I'll play it or not, though. I sort of just brought it as like a uh, a prop. It's just it's gonna menace. It's gonna stare up at us threateningly from the floor. Yeah, it'll do some of that, and then like <laughs> he's gonna stick his head in it and yeah. make some sounds and do a <laughs> dance. Uh. <laughs> You the no, but of course, you won't be able to see the dance. That's that's the thing. So. Well, no, no, this is this is radio, and they're supposed to imagine it. Yeah, yeah exactly. We're, we're hearkening back to simpler days. We, <laughs> This is the days of high definition radio, when you could uh, when you could draw the pictures in your own own head that were much more vivid than anybody was going to present them to you on TV. Absolutely, yeah. this okay. dance will be like that. <laughs> okay, so Mark, when when we were when you strolled in here getting set up, you're having a little bit of a chat. You're telling me that your uh, primary influence here is Ima Sumac. Is that right? Who? <laughs> no, come on. I, you mean Yamatu, Yamataka I? No, I, I'm trying to crack a joke on you guys, and you're not getting it. I'm oh, man. terrible at that. Oh, I hate it, you know, when you riff. <laughs> it, you, you, I, what good is it riffy if you don't have a straight man? Yeah. I, I, uh, <laughs> you, can't, you can't do that stuff to me. I, I take everything literally. That's okay. the first thing you got to learn about and me. And you, oh, you don't know Ima Sumac? N- uh, no, I can't say I do. Oh, voice of the X-Bay. This is the, you gotta, you got to reach back to the, uh, to the 50s and the early 60s. This, this is... She's kind of the the original uh, screwball vocal performer. Really, you know, a lot of you know whooping and swooping and stuff. Oh, cool. and, and she claimed to be to, to be to have been. Uh, you know, it wouldn't it wouldn't surprise me at all if her stuff was still in print either. I think Capital put it out, um, but she claimed to be descended from I don't know Incas or Mayans or some damn thing. But people kept pointing out over the years that her name spelled backwards was Amy Camus and that she was actually from New York. <laughs> but, uh, if, but if you haven't listened, if you haven't heard any any Ima Sumac, this, no, I haven't. Uh, then you, really, you really want to dig her stuff up because that's she's kind of a landmark in that show. I'll definitely check it out. For yeah, sure. I'll have to check it out for sure. Yep. And okay, well then, tell us tell us what you are influenced by. You know, I'm what, what can we expect out here today? Influenced by a lot of uh, John Zorin projects, uh, a lot of David Lynch films. Uh, I like. Mike Patton stuff. I like pretty much that. Those three things sum up my main influence for this style of uh, improv, noisy thingamajig that we're about to do. Yeah, I like all sorts of stuff, but that's pretty much where I get my inspiration from. Okay, and I like the boredoms too. I like a lot of noisy Japanese Mo- bands modern too. inspiration. Melt Banana is yeah. awesome. Oh, and yeah, and the, and the boredom's coming to town. It was part of this this festival that was just the recently announced. The Sled Island Festival. Sled Island, that's the one. That, yeah. where, where is that anyway? Where is it taking place? Uh, it's at a whole All bunch over. of different venues. Oh, so scattered around the city? Yeah. Scattered. So I know my, my band, Gunther's playing at the uh, the Marquee Room, I think, at some point. I'm and then at Broken City. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's at, it's at a few different at venues. The Legion, I think, too. I'm playing the Legion. That downtown Legion? I think so, yeah. Yeah, so it's scattered all over the place, it seems like. And, and when is it? Uh, Gunther's playing on the 28th of June, I think. No, the 20, yeah, the 28th of June. 
end of um, June. So yeah, the end of June. Spread around the end of June over a few days. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's going to be a gas to see the boredoms in this town. Yeah, yes. I know. Well, I got to get my yeah. tickets for that because otherwise I'll regret it. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> What a terrible thing. And you don't want to be missing out in Blue Oyster Cult this Saturday either. I gather that's about a 50 buck touch. Yeah, probably. Not crazy about that stuff. No. Um, no, the 50 <laughs> buck part. I love Blue Oyster Cult. Um, which some people seem to think is incongruous with doing a show like this, but guys, get, get over yourself. Uh, all right, so enough, ch- enough chatter. You want to get out there and make a racket? Yeah, for sure. Sure. Okay, well, if we can get the complicated microphone stuff happening here, step on up, gentlemen.
I think we're there. Let's see if these gentlemen are going to join me on that mic again. Are we back? I think we're back. Are we back? Yeah. Yeah. <coughs> I'm back. There, we're, we're all back. We're all back. <laughs> wow, that was, um, that was a real fucking mess. Thanks, dude. It certainly was. Yeah, all right. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, but a, a little, little equipment failure. Scott, did, did I see you uh, breaking a string there? Uh, yeah, I think I did. I actually broke several. Okay, but, but there will be other garage sales and other egg slicers. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, don't <laughs> worry. Don't worry, I'll find more. <clears throat> that was fun, by the way. Yeah, that, yeah, was, that was really great. Thanks, Chris. Thank you. Yeah, yeah nice for and thanks to you guys, for obviously, for having us. Well, always a pleasure, you know. <laughs> Very much. I mean, after all, the show's called Noise, and if Paul lets me into the place to, you know, put melodic music on the air all, all, the, all the time, then I was trying to convince where are we people. Be? Exactly. I was trying to convince people during that piece that this is something that they should be able to dance to. Yeah, me too. Oh, absolutely. Because uh, there's rhythms in there somewhere. <laughs> They should mimic the dance that it's I was It's their job well, to find them. Well, hold it a second. But who says there has to be rhythm in there in order to dance to it? Yeah, there's a few of them, though. That's a good point. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not a dancer, so I can't honestly say. I am. I was dancing the whole time. It was really beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> Just really we were all deep, We were all deeply moved. Nice. Chris was in a trance, I think, when we were uh, performing. Complete, complete trance. He was. From was the beginning to the end, trance. Yeah. I think there was a couple moments more, there where uh, I sort of lost control of that pedal, but I seemed to catch up to it just yeah. in the nick of time. Managed to rein it back in yeah. again. I yeah. didn't rein anything back in. <laughs> <laughs> and you managed to get the trombone out, too. Yeah, I did. I did. I even did a dance for those people watching out there. <laughs> we'll go see it. Yeah. People, people watching the Demented Head movies while they're listening to this. Yeah. So, uh, you guys... I mean, do you gig this racket around much town? Uh, uh, us too? No. No, this is the first time the two of us have actually yeah. ever done oh, uh, really? a we've, duo. We've discussed this before, but not... Uh, ah, 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 okay. <laughs> so we got ourselves like an honest-to-God radio debut here. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Cool. And but, world debut. But world. The, the, the three of us have done uh, improv stuff before. Yeah. In, with Bug Incision, but uh, this is the first vocal duet I've ever done. Okay. So me too. Yeah. And where does one typically find, uh, find your gigs? Chris? Um, we have them around, like a lot of them take place at either Emedia or Soda. Occasionally we've done stuff in a few other places, but generally it's Emedia or Soda. And the best place is just to myspace.com slash bug incision, and it's got everything listed on there, and it's got links to all Scott's other bands and Mark's projects and everything, and so it's all, it's all linked up through, uh, the internet. And, um, that magical device. Yeah, and that's where you can find out about it, and you can get <clears throat> if you become our friend, you can you can get a, <laughs> a, a oh, bulletin yeah, announcement Please whenever we have the gigs. Please become friend. And like that blah, blah, blah. MySpace and Facebook stuff. I can't do that shit, <clears throat> man. I can't yeah. stand that. I mean, the, you know, the, the reason I'm in here is because I don't want any friends. That's exactly. That, that's, <laughs> Me uh, too. Why the hell would I want to join? I can you know, respect that. You know, I can there's, there's, that. there's that old <laughs> saying: it's like I would I would never join a club. I would never want to join a club that would have me as a member. That's you a good point. Right? I've heard, yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, so I, I, the, 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 the notion of social networking and being in touch with people just completely, completely turns my stomach. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, it, it can get out of hand if you let it, for sure. It's, uh, yeah. you, can, you can get gigs with it. It's, yeah, that's a good point. It's good for, it's good for music. Oh, well, the, yeah, but, you, but you, can get, you, can, you can call it a gig if you stand on the street corner of the pig nose and scream, too. And it doesn't mean that you're, that's 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 you're gathering I'd, friends. I was just going to say I'd pay to see that. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you can pay me. I'll do it right now. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Okay, so coming other sh- now, no, uh, Chris, we, we, we're going to have to. Uh, although we are, ha- are going to have to make a little greater effort to communicate because, yes. as I say, Paula just kind of threw me this mail. And said, "Yes, hey, no, you're going to do a whole sure bunch of this either. stuff in the yeah. next few weeks, and I'm beating it out of town now." And then, for, did, and then failed to give me your address. Oh, okay. Um, so what have you got coming up here in the, uh, uh, coming the next up few weeks next we'll month, to attention to? Next month, we have uh, Jay Crocker, uh, Eric Hamlin, and J.C. Jones. That's on June 21st. They're going to be playing. They've been working as a trio. They've been rehearsing extensively for the last couple months, and they're going to be playing the Jazz Fest on June 20th. And then um, they'll be playing here on the 21st, so they'll be fresh and ready to go. Um, and then in uh, July, which I think is the 19th, 
or the seventeenth. It's on the website. Whatever the third Thursday of the month is, <coughs> um, I believe we have slated Mall Eagle, which is a project um, of myself and Brooke of Buckingham. They're awesome. We just played on Thursday night. We had our live debut. This will be our radio debut um, in July. Other than that, there'll be a, a Bug Incision concert coming up in August with Peter Evans, a trumpeter from New York, a very exciting solo trumpet artist. Um, really interesting stuff. He's going to be here in August. And, uh, yeah, I think that's that's mainly... The Bent Spoon, part of the Bent Spoon trio is going to England next month to, to tour uh, four dates in England. So that's kind of exciting as well. Um, and that's that's what we got going on, really. There's some action. This town isn't dead. A little no, bit of action. Not. Yeah. <clears throat> surprise, surprise. All right. Okay. Well, then I'm going to uh, I think we'll sign off here. I've got to. I got a few minutes before to to get things kind of settled back down and let the reverberation die <laughs> before Marco comes in. Uh, so I'll thank you, thank you, gentlemen, for uh, for having come into the studio. It was terrific. You're thank welcome. You. And uh, you know, and uh, for having us. I know. I, I and I expect to get uh, to catch all kinds of trouble for this. Once Good. people wake up tomorrow and start calling the station, it's like, what the <laughs> hell? That isn't uh, Nickelback. What's going on? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay. So, again, thanks very much. Um, I'm CC Berger. You're listening to Noise, the last 15 minutes. And let's uh, move on with a little bit of PDQ Bach. <laughs> 